What's up guys, this is the Rifleman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Title War. Let's play as the United States. So the round of where we left off, we are finally attacking the last French bastion of Corsica. And there are many, many troops that will be entering the field of battle today. So hopefully things things go our way. Um, we're probably going to be, need to be fairly offensive to get hold of these mortars before they start to do too much damage. And we'll probably need to find some handy way to chop up this reinforcing army. But yes, let's crack on. Um, we have two reinforcing armies waiting to back us up. So ultimately there's three stacks I'm sending in to defeat a faction from uh, from the game completely. Because um, then they'll leave their regions in the Americas completely exposed. So that's the... That's the Okay, so there's the town. So if memory serves, my reinforcements and their reinforcements are going to come... F okay, so I, I attacked from the... Okay, well this is the east. Did I attack from the east? Well, if I'm looking at the town, I've, I think the stuff comes from there. I think. So I'm like... Gamble. Oh, do I kind of do semi? Do I load up some artillery here? And then do sort of... At least some sharpshooters and some infantry here to act as a bit of a defensive unit. You know, put down some stakes, do some handy dandy blockading, that kind of thing. So actually, let's just deploy you in front of them for now. Let's turn fire well off. This is going to be a little, a small redoubt. I'm not quite sure how it's going to go. But if I do that, and then I can sprint my skirmishers out to the... To be honest, actually, only one of you needs to go. So actually, I might just put you here. Oh, well, I might just be more... Yeah, let's do that, actually. Let's deploy the stakes there. Makes more sense. Maybe I've rambled far too long. Far too... For far too long about that bit. Let's get my other two guns to go here and probably move up to say probably about here and start lobbing some shells. I'm tempted to leave these skirmishes here as well, just to add even more stakes. Just in case, because they always try to rush the guns and because they've got so many troops coming in, unless they come from the back. But I don't think they should. That'll do for now. So they're going to advance up this flank with the remainder of my infantry. Actually, that's far too squashed at the minute. There's not really a lot I can do about it. Let's split these into almost two squadrons. Generals, stay behind with the guns. It's ultimate, so the reason why I'm being a bit cagey here is because I've got these other armies coming in in reinforcement. Um, so I want to have a bit of a structure, a bit of a holding point somewhere, without throwing all my eggs in one basket. Okay, okay, cool, so they're over there. Since all their mortars are on the go, so we're going to need to be pretty arachnetic. You, you, and you. All deploy stakes. To be honest, I can probably fire with those. Because oh, absolutely, I can fire with those. Oh, I see loads and loads of deaths. Oh, god damn you, mortars! Oh, let's not get the guns in. I need to advance up in good order, rapidly. Let's take you guys. one unit to secure the square. Let's put you there. Let's put you there. And then advance up slowly. You are, shouldn't absolutely not be walking, particularly as clumped in as you are. 
Here should be okay. They'll lob shells up over my infantry. Is the hope. Ah, some art Ah! Some artillery is blowing the hell out of this supporting unit, which is nice. Let's go over and check my skirmishes. To be honest, I might actually just deploy them actually like this. I don't I rarely do this because it's it's not usually well I've never really found it too much of a good idea. But by the looks of it, I think I should be able to deploy these guys and they'll fire over the men. Although to be honest, it doesn't look like there's much of a cavalry threat, so. Okay, you've already made it up, so. Advance in position. I want to maximise my firepower and not get engaged in any silly little melee combats. So advance up slowly, because they are advancing over here. That's where my artillery is, so that will... Okay, let's keep getting my artillery actually firing. Firing the center now. There was a unit I sent to garrison here, but I guess I've moved them. So these guys are going to get chopped up. But I'm okay with that. I primarily want them to move up to put some fire onto these uh, militia units. Onto these um, howitzer units. The general's coming out. Which would be interesting if he does fancy a wee look. So deploy your guns. Our misses have managed to make a garrison near route, which is lovely. So they have reformed their line. So unfortunately this fire like on citizenry is gonna last a bit longer than I hoped. Yep, yeah, they're getting some f being f getting some shots fired at them. I hope the hope is I can knock out these as far like I'm citizenry quick enough that ooh, that's where they're coming in, is it? So is that these guys? You guys fire long onto that artillery unit. Yeah, these guys are in very dire straits. Ooh, that shrapnel shot. Hey, my garrison unit was here all along. Let's run them out. Yeah, I didn't see the cavalry charge in time. Good, good, good. Let's move up. Well, actually, let's not move. Up. Let's not be too crazy. Let's take the new positions. Yeah, generals charge these guys. Form square, even though it's way too late. Let's still give it a go. Fire like I'm seriously routing. The cap artillery is doing a decent job, so keep lobbing those shells in. Go back to these guns and start hitting. That's an incoming unit. them into here because there's two cavalry units or to be honest actually run here because you wavering see they're all eager and I don't uh, probably better third forming square and kind of semi anchoring on this square formation artillery's lobbing shells are lobbing in shots are lobbing in sorry oh god quick climb sorry guys oh they missed we're too close Yeah, so they're going to rout. Yeah, absolutely fair enough. This square is going to be shot to pieces. But the hope is... Okay, can, are these guys now firing on... Fire on that unit. We've got one army coming in, reinforcing from this direction. 
Squares his health firm and they've charged straight on. So I want to send some guys over here to encircle this. Well, you engage that artillery unit. You rush in and engage that artillery unit. Quick limb shots are too short range. Unit firing square. Oh, some howitzers are coming in. Do they move? You guys. That is terrible news for me that they have an artillery unit still going. Well, if they just. Yeah, they've left their mortars. Yeah, that's going to hit them painfully. 198. 178, not so bad. To be honest, I might be able to suicide them around. Soup. Worth it trying to get a flank around. This unit has survived its mauling in square formation. To be honest, I know I'm kind of suiciding this unit, but I really need to knock out that unit of howitzers. Okay, so here comes some. Uh -oh. Um, okay. So, you do that. Okay, artillery to start drop lobbing shots in on this regiment, because that... Let's run them over here so they're not surrounded. Not a good position, that's for sure. But everyone's firing. Oh god, there's another more team. But they've absolutely missed. But yeah, my point is if I run them here, at least there's no one at their back. It's all moving along. Artillery's still coming in. got to be running low on ammunition. So this must be where the bulk of the new army is coming in, so I want to reallocate troops to go support that flank. Got fire into the rear of Regiment 4. Fourth Regiment of Provincial Line. Good. Good, this unit's doing some devastating volleys into the flank. 56th Regiment of Foot. Well, it's only a matter of time before these guys break. But at the very least, they will have done some sterling work. In Ooh, okay. So they're still coming in. So all my, well, everyone apart from these skirmishes are behind protective cover. Retarget that infantry into that infantry. What the hell's going on over here still? These guys all still have targets. They are looking mighty under strength. There's not really a lot they can do apart from maybe fall back. You make these guys garrison this house. These guys have done a very good job of keeping these guys suppressed. Form a little square formation. Yeah, this army's absolutely going to break. Right now it's it's stretched mightily thin. No, stay where you are, you're in a good position. Their routing is a put in square formation, but that's okay. 
Ooh, cavalry. <gasps> My field marshal. My field marshal's coming in. All my skirmishes are opening up, even the ones that I can't shoot because of the range. Wrong, wrong artillery battery. Let's take you guys. You guys hit them because these skirmishers have zero cover. Onwards, my men! Don't hit the don't hit this this section of the fight. This section of the fight is for safe. Who's that? Third light foot. Hit that chasseur unit. Absolutely take out that light unit. They shot you in the back as well. Infantry unit, artillery units coming around to join them. Good, the light infantry are massacring these gendarmerie. Good. Artillery hit them. You must probably start to trap them shot. Oh, yes. Why are these horse guard units so big? I know you're household cavalry units, but damn! Okay, let's watch out for the spikes. Yeah, the lion's crumbling. Who's that? Right, regiment, good there. Ooh. Oh no, 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 don't do that. It's a lovely, lovely, lovely household guard. Just chewing up the line infantry unit. Shot them to bits. And limber. Let's get the fire shrapnel into them. Yep. Yeah. Uh, actually, no. Maybe I do want to limber you up. Maybe I do want to do that. Because <laughs> there's, they are there is infantry and there's cavalry on the loose. Let's pull you back. Let's pull you back. Let's pull my general back, and it looks like this is where a new army is going to come in. So anything. Let's probably. You guys leg it because they're going to chase after these poor units. They're going to die. The mighty 77th. Oh, wow. You can get the hell out of there. Do this and let's start to form. New little formation. And are they. As I say, if they were enterprising, they could chase down my artillery units. But let's hope they aren't enterprising. But I have to remember, we are attacking. First and foremost, so let's deploy my skirmish line. Let's start to deploy another infantry line. Oh, yes. Elite units, that's what I'm talking about. Be nice. Start to move you guys up. Move you guys up here. Move you guys up here. Do a bit of scouting with my house on cavalry and my this new my field marshal of Europe. Let's 
we're currently falling back through the town en masse, but ultimately I do think we are in a better position. Survive, are going to survive through the through holding on. These guys now within shrapnel range. They are. To be honest, you guys might actually run to there and provide fire. Yes, shrapnel shots. Yes, yes, yes. Look at that. Scoot much skirmishes up. Artillery no longer firing shrapnel is going to hit these regiments of line. Although, to be honest, these are fresh units, they've not suffered very many losses, they will perform admirably. Massed artillery, the morale is shaken. advancing my guards around the flank this new general unit you can oh hello who's this a reinforcing unit that look delicious get them before they deploy stakes Well, actually, no, let's watch that. My general is in difficulty. No, he's not. Not with that many bodyguards. So this guy's in the flank to keep an eye on. Let's rotate them around. Some two of these guys are on to skirmish this regiment of foot. It's another infantry unit. They're deploying stakes. as much good as you had. Don't really have an excellent view. These chaps do. If he gets into position, there we go. And him. Come on, men. Good. It's 20 men fell in the first volley. Good. Let's keep pushing around the flank. Ooh, shooting at my household cavalry. It's absolutely run them back. Expatriates join the line. Mortars run up to here. So the artillery unit got absolutely smacked from somewhere, whoever it is. 
They all die before entering the line, apparently. Let's get this gun team. Let's get into Limber up, because there's only so much support they can provide now. Cross the airs around to support them. Quick line range isn't great. This gun team. Let's set you up right here. Yeah, loads of them are dying before they get anywhere near. God knows why. Because there's mortar batteries blocking. The infantry from joining the battle. Let's march the infantry up. Okay, let's do this instead. Let's fall back my my skirmishers. So my cuirassiers have a clear run in. get my skirmishers back to firing up towards the hill. Steady, you've been, you've been tired, you've been pecked out with skirmishers, that should be enough to cause you to break and flee in terror. Can you even limber up? Yeah, you can. Although I did press the button before, but I don't know why you didn't. Okay, let's get you here to hold tired, hold pole position, and get ready to charge back into this unit. This lone battery is beginning to fire. In, let's take my general, skirt the flank, scout the flank, skirt the flank. So the town center has four of them. Well, I'll hit those chasseurs up here because these guys look like they're gonna. Okay, cavalry, 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 where's my nearest cavalry? Horse guards. Square. Let's curve that flank around. Yep, so they have managed to get in a hit. Skirmish to the town to secure key points. Let's get the wrong way for the men in the town hall. Let's get you in. Here. Get the 12th light foot to take this building behind enemy lines. Set of spikes. To be honest, they're not very really super useful in this sort of fight. Take a safe position. Do 
not interested in chasing down stragglers. Let's not engage these guys in a gun battle. Charge them in melee combat. Horse guards to stand up here in a scary looking position. Particularly if I was a fleeing Frenchman. Although, to be honest, I don't rate their chances. Oh no, I almost, almost made a massive cock up, didn't I, everyone? Almost I'm charging straight at these riflemen at, well, at these infantry right through these uh, cavalry spikes. I'm a bit dumb, but I'm not super dumb. Lone gun to hit this unit. Let's get this game just over here, actually. Oh, victory. Oh god, that was a that was, that was the entire part. Really. Well, it felt like a bit of a slog, I tell you that. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. But still, that was a mighty battle that knocks out the French Empire from this campaign as their empire as their stacks fall time and time and time again. And Corsica is ours. Yeesh. Well, that deserves a fortification, I think. To preserve the gains of our gallant troops. At the and a whole bunch of money spent on particularly these artillery crews that just spent their time yes, dying. Sir. Excellent. Officer let's get this Alvin. army, let's get this navy in port. Whew. Sweet. And that also means this region has become a pirate region, which will be captured next turn. Uh, the Mexican army. They're going to stay under siege because look at all those mortars. Holy Seven moly. And we'll move on. Say Santa Fe, Texas, Low Louisiana, Upper Louisiana. Actually, have I not got. Have I not been smart and actually kept. Kept armies around? I have not. In which case, then. So navies. Not really. Not really any armies. Surprised we haven't got any. Not objectives, I want lists. Location of Virginia. No, no, like major armies in yeah, yeah, Gibraltar. Fort, Fort who? Ah, that's a bit funny. Corsica, Corsica. Ooh, that's, that looks like one that might be relevant. Wherever it's gone. Well, put to pay. Ah, I didn't check um, the Caribbean islands. It's a kind of one in Jamaica. No, it's more of a garrison. I've got one in Caracas being recruited. Well, this is a good starting point. So let's get six more units of line infantry. <gasps> two legions, two units of legion, unit of Republican Guard, and two units of line. Cool. Then this army. Oh no, wait. Six. Yeah. Sweet. And this army will go on. And it will, I suppose it'll start knocking out the Windward Islands. Then hit Louisiana. And I've got to keep an eye out for these pirates. Keep an eye out for these chaps. I may even... Recruit an army up here still. Because I do have lots of fragments. Like these chaps. Waiting for your order. Some troops at Albany. Let's give you a general and then let's start recruiting. So let's get unit of household cavalry. That's the last bit. Colonial light cavalry. Let's try out a rocket troop. Three units of 24 pounders. Two units of 24 pounder howitzers. And then probably some sort of. Did the first Maryland get destroyed somewhere? Must have done. 
Then let's get you in oh, Provincial Scouts. Yeah, actually, that'd be all of it. That's all of it. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's all my specialist infantry and stuff like that. Cool. Sorry, not sorry. New Nation Arises. Huron. Yeah. New Nation Arises. Pueblo Nations. Yep. Not for long, though. Sorry, the Mayan Rebels are going to go down. Then we're going to be after you. Um, anyway, yes, looking at the timer. I actually let's recruit that. God, that. Uh, but yes, looking at the timer. That's definitely the end of this part. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed the final destruction of the French Empire. And we will see you next time.